here. We're protesting. Yeah. Hopefully someone will hear us. Someone protesters say like a city official. On Tuesday evening, Palestinian supporters gathered outside Austin City Hall to call on city council to pass a resolution calling for a ceasefire in the Israel Hamas war. So since the current ceasefire resolution is not going to pass, we are going to be here today demanding a different kind of ceasefire resolution. The protesters are demanding the city cut any financial ties with Israel, along with condemning University of Texas at Austin President Jay Hartzell for his police response to protests on campus. Can you talk to me a little bit about what you hope city officials gain from this protest today? I think city officials need to take into account that people overwhelmingly support a ceasefire, overwhelmingly support Palestinian liberation, and after the attacks that we've had on Palestinian individuals here, Palestinian students on campus. We stand with those students, with those community members. About 100 Austinites gathered to join the peaceful demonstration. One protester says he's grateful for his protected right of free speech. The, the First Amendment protects our right for protest, especially if it's peaceful protest like that. I'm not a religious person. As a human, my humanity forces me to be here. Organizers say this isn't the last time they'll be knocking on City Hall's door calling for a response to the unrest in Gaza. Stand for liberation, stand for what's right, and are against this genocide. And if you're watching at home and you support, we appreciate you, but we also want you out here. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.